Welcome back to Lake Mills. We are on the road where we've been all week. I'm Jocko, that's Elizabeth. Yep. And right now we are at the beautiful Town and Country Days Festival, but we've been exploring this crazy town all week, haven't we? Yeah, it's really windy. It's not looking beautiful for me right now, but Lake great. Mills, on the other hand, it's awesome. Yes, it a is. lot of people coming out. Really cool spot I found in town I wanted to talk about. It's a pottery studio and gallery. It's just off of the square here, about a block away. And it's really neat in a really cool building on the outside. And when you go in, you might not know that downstairs is really an underground pottery city. They have 10 full-time artists here and at least three artists touch each piece of handmade pottery before it's done. One to throw the pot, then comes a sculpting artist and then someone who glazes it. A team effort to create these really one-of-a-kind masterpieces. I love as much handmade as we can possibly do. I love the idea that it's hand thrown, not using molds to, th to make the pieces, and then everything's hand sculpted. So actually when you get a piece from us, it's going to be kind of a one of a kind because it's not going to have come out of a mold. If you see a frog on something or um, different leaves on things, each one is going to be a little bit different. And after stopping at the Pottery Gallery, take a short walk over to Lewis Station Winery and Distillery. It's been here since 2011, but new within the past year, the shop has now added spirits. They make unique types like this lavender vodka and cucumber vodkas. Mm. They also have a full service kitchen. The owner says she saves lives having her winery in Lake Mills because of the small town charm. And the fact that it's close to the interstate, which brings in travelers from all over the state. And I think that's the thing we talked about Lake Mills for my whole life. I'm a Wisconsinite my whole life is that it's, you know, it's right in between Madison and Milwaukee. Yeah. And you know, you've seen the exit a million times and just stop off and, and say hi to everybody and visit all these cool places. And this is a great weekend to do that, highlighting the town and country days. The sun is even coming yes. out, Chaco. The rain what a has held off. Time. It's going to be a great weekend for weather. Kevin has the first alert forecast for us.